Hey guys, Super Foxy, welcome back to the channel. As you can see, we're now moving on to part six of the quarry. So we are currently mm -hmm. playing as Dylan. Our current objective is to head to the scrapyard with Caitlyn because, of course, we had to go get car parts, so we can get the hell out of here eventually. Um, without further ado, let's just get on with that. See what we got going on right now. August twenty third, Dylan, two ten Hackett's Quarry, exit road, Have you been chapter there nine, the main scrapyard. Nah, just seen the sign on my way to camp. Okay. What if we just, like, walk to the main road? This isn't the main road? No, this is all Hackett property. The main road is another Ooh. mile that way. Wait, how do I know so much more about everything than you do? Wait, shut up! So basically, it's another hour walk to the main road, and then at least another three to four hour walk until we hit the nearest... whatever? Oh, this is lovely. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck what was, was that? that? Oh god, I forgot Caitlyn has a gun. Just keep moving. Has the gun. Okay. One of the guns. Oh, this is gonna be so, lovely. I guess this is me now. Yeah, no hands. What? You're gonna look great with a hook. We can call you the Hooky and the Coke Face. Like a pirate? <laughs> Depressed, no one will treat me the same or positive. I guess it is kind of unique. Uh, let's be positive. Fuck that depressed shit. Yeah, I guess it's pretty unique. <laughs> I could get different attachments for it. Oh my yeah, God. man. Lean into it. One hell of a story, too. Yeah, I guess it's something to talk about on the radio station. We're all going to be laughing about this in a few years. You, me, maybe even Ryan. That's if we all survive. Uh, curious. Think we missed our shot or reflective? Need some me time. Uh... Missed our shot as in with Ryan? Ah, uh, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna be curious. Kinda got close at the fire pit back there. Am I crazy or was something about to happen? Is that was next year, right? Well, let's get through this year first. Something like what? Doesn't really matter anyway. It looks pit. like we finally know Ryan's type. Confident, and heroic, Ugh. with an eye patch. It's oh a pirate. Maybe she shivers his timbers. <laughs> there. All right, scrapyard. Here we are. Are we gonna run into? The oh shit! Relax. It's a motion sensor. Jesus We're okay. fuck! Had scared the I fuck think. out of me for no reason. Oh look, steampunk's back in. Ew, come on, this way. Why'd she say ew? Ugh. Okay then. August 23rd, Abigail, 212 Hackett's Quarry Lodge, Storm Shelter. Ooh, we got Abby and Emma over here. Now make so what do we do now? I'm just playing. Well, I guess we just make ourselves at home. Live up some cocktails, see what's on the TV. <laughs> huh? Wow. Um, annoyed, cut it out, Emma. Curious, why are you so positive? Um, we don't want to be annoyed. I mean, that's her boo, bro. At least in my book, we're gonna be curious. Why are you so positive? <laughs> Why are you always so positive? Ugh, why do you keep asking me that? Uh, I asked you about your confidence, not your whatever is happening right now. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I just don't like to see other people sad. I think she has depression. Friendly, oh please. Curious, is that why you do videos? Um, <laughs> we'll be friendly. Oh please. What? Is that really what you think of your followers? Just a bunch of sad sacks that need you to cheer them up? Oh, well, come after me. Don't come after my followers. My emanation. Emanation. You really need to come up with a better name for that. That's kind of oh, cute. Yeah, I do. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, that was kind of cute. Emanation. Emma, <sighs> who's enjoying your company? Fuck this night, huh? Yeah. Come on. I wanna hear you say it. Say what? 
Fuck this night. Fuck it all the way to morning. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Okay, but can we get them two closer together? I mean, I know they're best friends, but like... Put me down! That's what I mean. Easy, uh, August Mother and Laura, 1215 Hacky Family House. Oh, that's right, we met the Hackies! Are most of the family members. Oh, shit. We gotta shoot a bitch? Everybody just relax. Can't shoot what you can't see, darling. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Yeah, sure, turn the lights off. Are we gonna shoot a bitch or are we gonna. Yeah, I was about to say. Gotcha! That's. Travis's. Okay, you did to my kid. Travis and, uh. Chris's mother. I'm just. Holy shit! I just fucking killed her. Path update. Oh my god. Also, I never got to learn her name. I just Everybody stop! Fucking face off. Constance. Who's this guy? Wait, what the fuck is going on? Constance. Here? Her name is Constance. Uh, uh, wake up. Wake up. Uh, uh, she just got her face wait. blown off. I don't think that's going to help. Okay, so the mother's name is Constance. Is this guy supposed to be like her husband? She's gone. Little Bobby. Mom's gone. Cool. Wait, are they all siblings or I'm confused? Is that Travis' no dad hurting. shit or No more protecting anyone. Travis. Uh oh shit, yeah, run off Laura. Whoa, 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 okay. Yeah, block that shit. Let's not get shot. Gosh, fucking Ryan gets stabbed. Jesus fuck. I thought he would have been able to escape out of that. Nope. Apparently not. Uh, are we gonna go back for Jacob at least? Or... Is that gonna be something that's going to happen later on? I mean, I don't know how much more we have of this game. Probably maybe like a few hours left. All right, Haggett Family House, August twenty third, Ryan, two twenty six. Uh, living room? Where the fuck are we? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay, Ryan, you're probably losing right, a lot of good. blood there, bud. I wouldn't pull that out if I were you. It's best not to do something like that. Uh, pull knife? Yeah, let's not pull the knife. Let's not do that, because once you pull it out, it's gonna have blood gushing out. It's the only thing blocking it out. Alright, death chosen. He might end up fucking dying if we would've just pulled that right out. Alright, uh, looks like we're gonna do a little explore now. Okay, cool, great. I mean, I guess I can somewhat see around this area. Alright, um, window to the outside. Can't really leave yet. I'm pretty sure we have to go for Jacob. And then maybe go after Laura. Uh, anything on the couch here? Jesus, fuck, he's having a hard time walking. Uh, anything right here? I do not know what that is. Alongside the lamp and the chair. And then, you know, I got this little desk thing, dresser. Uh, can't see what that is. Looks like some sort of plant. Uh, but there is something right here. What are we looking at? Some sort of little casing thing is... What is that? Is that silver? I can't really tell what that is. Or were those cufflinks? I mean, we got a piece of paper out of that. Is that like a clue? Evidence? Some shit? Evidence collected. Kaylee's letter. Kaylee was Chris's daughter. The girl that was shot in the pool by Laura. I think at the time she was a werewolf when it happened, though. Um, okay, what is this? Is like some, car some sort of mirror here? I think this is a mirror. Yes, I see my reflection. Looks a little busted up, though, because reflection isn't really popping in all that well. Um, anything important over here? Not really much. This looks like a TV with cable and shit. Sorry, I'm trying to look extra hard just in case I might miss something, because, again, I've missed a lot of things over the first few episodes. 
parts. What are we looking at? Why are you freaking out? I thought I'd say, well, we got a little secret door back there, but no, apparently not. Okay. Nice. Um, you know, now that I'm looking at it, this kind of looks like some sort of bedroom, unless this house is just really small and, you know, like, the bedrooms are in the, where the living room area is, if that's what this is. Okay, uh, what are we checking here? Under the bed. We got anything that we need to be looking for? Any first day? Oh, gross. Oh. That is fucking shit. Yeah. Someone's been shitting in a bucket using the bathroom there. I wonder how much of the family, though, right here is, like, werewolves and junk. I mean, I don't really see anything else around here. I think we might as well just go through this door right here. If it's not locked. Is it locked? We're gonna look at people? I'm gonna assume that guy right there is that Bobby dude. Uh, block door or hide. Uh, let's block the door. I don't think hiding... There's no really anywhere to hide. Oh shit, never mind. Probably just fucked up. Is that guy from Bobby? Is that where that guy is right there? Dude, no problem. Oh shit. Ah! Spam, 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 spam! Oh, I just broke my thumb over here, just spamming that button. Honestly, that's how it feels sometimes. I'm just spamming the button over and over again. Uh, I don't think there's really anywhere to run, dude. This dude's gonna follow you no matter what. I mean, you can do that too. Cool. You can't hide from me in my own house, fucker! Uh, You're a fucker. Oh, <laughs> You're a fucker. Yeah, we gotta love being childish, but I mean, at the same time, that motherfucker is probably trying to kill us. Haggett Family House, August 23rd, Laura, 2.35. Okay? Where is she headed to? Hide or run? Uh, if we hide, they're probably gonna find us, but if we run, we're probably gonna be found either way. So, you know what, fuck it. It's a win or lose situation, and we couldn't really tell which is which. Alright, we gotta hold our breath. Great. Gotta hold down until it's not going red, beeping red here. Jesus, fuck. I can hear you breathing, little girl. Um, how much longer do we gotta hold this up? Okay, never mind. We're good. I was about to say, it didn't seem like she was holding her breath all that well, so... Uh, yeah, Laura, make a run for it. I don't know where exactly it is she's trying to run off to. I'm gonna be honest, I think the only reason why Ryan and Laura came here was literally to find Chris. Can't even do that. And now look at the situation they're in. Oh great, some exploring around, huh? Alright, uh, house looks like it's falling apart a little bit. Must be a really old house. But I mean, looking at the mirror, this place kind of seems old-fashioned, so I'd assume it's probably like over a hundred years old. Ooh, piano! What will happen if I just mess with it? Are we gonna mess with it or are we gonna close it? Don't wanna play it? Ah, fuck it. Do it, do it, do it. I mean, we're probably being chased anyway, so what the fuck does it matter if we... <sighs> Never mind. You're just blowing dust there. You gonna continue playing it there? Yeah, uh, never mind. I was about to say. It might attract someone over here, but I mean, why would it give us the option to do that? That's whatever. Alright, what's this? What is this right here? We're looking at a skull. Clue discovered hunting here? trophy wall. That's a bear skull? 
Is that a bear skull or is that a werewolf skull? I mean, looking up now, I realize that these people are big hunters. So, I mean, you got the deer mounts on the wall. Okay then, uh, might as well just head upstairs, I guess. Oh, shoot, that's a lot of animal mounts you got there, mainly deers and junk, but then over here, you got like, I want to say that's a... What is that? Is that some sort of like cougar or whatever? What the fuck is that? And again, you got like more different deers. And then like with the skull on the wall with the antlers. That's fucking lovely. I know a lot about that because my grandfather's a hunter. Great. Alright, where shall we head to next? Anything interesting here? Other than this damn mirror, you can look at ourselves. Uh, That's clearly a distraction. Also, I don't know if it's just the lighting, but like, is this stuff all over the floor right here, like blood or something, or is it like the paint scuffing away? I can't tell. Um, I think we could go over that way. I just realized there's a dead plant right there. Can't really see it because of the angle. But uh, we're gonna look in whatever this room is. Uh, looks like a sort of room. What is this? A hunting certificate? Uh, clue discovered Hackett family tree. Okay, so it's not a hunting certificate. It's just a family tree. Um... Couldn't really see all of who was on that, but... I think the lowest ones on that family tree, like more recent, was like Chris. I can really see. I've seen like one name. Ooh, what's this? Uh, can't really see what that says. Uh, can I look at that again? Because I can really tell what that said. Uh, show text. Receipt note. These cages should not hold. or should not. Sorry, I read that completely wrong. These cage should hold Chris, Caleb, and Kaylee. Okay, so those are who are werewolves in the Hackett family? When camp's over, they can keep hunting the white wolf. The white wolf. He's gotta come back sooner or later. Later, It'll be safe if we use blood. Last thing we need is more casualties. T. So wait. It'll be safe if we use blood. Is that what they had going on for Jacob? Is that why he had blood splattered on him? It's, so, it's supposed to protect from like being infected by the wolves or something? Like if you get bit? Also, the freaking TV right here is like glowing. Well, not the TV, but it looks like a little DVD player. Also, did we look right here? Oh, yeah, that's right. The little family tree thing. They got another freaking mountain the wall right there. They must have, like, millions of mounts or something. Yeah, there's one right there, too. They must be very rich people or something. But either way, this house looks pretty old and pretty big, so... What do we get out of that? Okay, wait, where are we going? Gotta go this way. Gotta head further. I don't know if there's anything else important right there, but I didn't really see anything. Um, okay. Into another big-ass fucking room. Oh, here we go. We gotta tear it called the sun. Tear it found. Okay. Cool. 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 Thankfully we ran across that. Although the fact that these windows are blocked off with wood is kind of suspicious. Is there something we're supposed to be looking at here? Should I be worried? Wait. Was that someone outside of the window? Like, when we stood- hold on, no. When we stood over there, I could've sworn I seen something in, like, the corner over there. Like, is there someone just standing there? Or was that just a reflection in a weird position here? Uh, anything, anything that we could possibly find? Nope, not much. Just go straight into a cutscene, okay? <laughs> Jesus, fuck. Oh my god, Laura's eyes are turning yellow. She's about to transform soon, you guys. Holy shit. Oh 
god. We ain't playing games no more, little girl. Try me, motherfucker. No. No. <laughs> you know something? I bullet? ain't got enough silver to kill you, but I sure the hell can make you suffer. Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> Oh, hell no, nah, bro. Stab us. <coughs> Fuck. Yeah, knock that old ass motherfucker over, Laura. Thankfully, it's giving us enough time to uh, enough time to move and make an action. Yeah, fuck out my face, motherfucker. Ooh. Uh, run or attack. Uh, maybe we should run, but I don't know if he has another bullet for us, you know? Fuck it, we're gonna run. Anyways. Motherfucker, run! What the fuck? Hey, what's your position? What's your position? Yep, see? Gun on hand. What's your position? Is that... Do they all have, like, a walkie-talkie to make contact with each other or something? What the fuck just happened? Hello? Oh. Turning lights off. Hello, Jacob. Oh my god, we probably should have saved him. Jacob? We're about to get fucked up, dude. No, 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 wait, wait, no! Oh, shit. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, so maybe it was probably a better idea if I saved him, but you know what, fuck it, I don't really give too much you? fucks about Jacob. I'm not gonna hey! lie. Whoa. Everybody fucking stop right now! Okay, officer. Shoot her. Take her face off. You know what she did to Kaylee? And she killed your mother, too. Oh my fucking god. Does he feel remorse towards her? Wait, what's it? There was a reason why Travis didn't shoot Laura. Uh, Hackett Family House, August 23rd, Ryan, 240. But there was a reason why Travis didn't shoot Laura there. It's got me freaking out a little bit. Ryan, for God's sake. You're probably gonna end up getting grabbed. That's a weird little shape corridor on the wall there. This looks like some Michael Myers type shit. It's just a little area in between the walls right there. Oh god damn it, now we gotta fucking go into a whole breath sequence. God damn it, I fucking hate it. I love how he just didn't look anywhere near the fucking hole in the wall right there. Like, that's crazy. Now this is really cramping my thumb up. Okay, we are good. Oof. Uh, trophy earned. You're breathtaking. Uh, nice. I guess. Um, I don't think stopping there is the best thing to do. But. Damn, everyone in this game's getting fucked up somehow. You gotta help me. I do? Yeah, I promise. I won't tell anyone anything. No, man. Family first. Besides, I'll get in trouble. Uh, do I want to stab him? Nah, let's not do it. Maybe Please. we can get him on our side. You stole my knife. Ah! Ah! Half updated. Uh... 
Oh, hello. Oh, no, you've been bit. Pick on someone your own size. Travis! Oh, oh, God, is she going to start transforming now? What the fuck happened to you? Oh, you know, nothing out of the ordinary. See, is the smell of his blood going to, like, make her transform faster? Oh, how bad is it? Oh god, this like looks like someone started a period bad. Got all that blood so still in that. That bad, huh? Oh pff. clearly. I keep trying to fix it. Whatever this is, people keep getting hurt. First Max. How and now she's blaming herself. Sympathetic or mocking. It's not your fault or I didn't want to say it. Uh let's be sympathetic. Now's not to be. No, now's not the time to mock a person. It's not your fault. I didn't have to come here. I shouldn't have let you come. Uh, you're not the boss of me. <laughs> Fair enough. Sorry. It's okay. You gonna like put pressure on that, make it stop Am going I dying? out, or? You've lost a lot of blood. But it'll, it'll heal though, right? We need to get you to the hospital there, bud. Her, we need to kill the werewolf Wait. that started all of this. Maybe it, maybe right, the it curse will. curse or whatever, I think that's what it is. This what? whole werewolf thing is a curse. Ryan, if you let me bite you... What? If you let me bite you, it means you'll be infected, which means... Which means it will heal. Yeah. Oh, God, is... Are we gonna let her But it also bite means... Him? Yeah, yeah, I got it, big bad wolf. Yeah. <sighs> Ryan, I don't have much time. I can feel it like it's fighting to get out. If you let me bite you and you heal, then, then I have to kill Chris. It's, it's not killing Chris. It's killing a werewolf. It's saving your own life. Oh, and God. mine. And Max's and your friend's. We're too. gonna have to make a hard decision here. I can already fucking see it. Oh, God. Let you bite me. And live to kill Chris Hackett. Or bleed out and die. Pretty much, yeah. I don't know what to it's do, your guys. Call for now. Fuck, dude. I mean, so did he this or pretty no? much get stabbed in the fucking heart? Accept or decline? I mean, do we even know 100% for sure if Chris is the werewolf that caused all of this? Oh, shit, guys. I don't know what to do. If we decline, literally Ryan's gonna fucking die. You know what fuck it will accept. Making a really tough decision here. Do it. Path chosen. Is this going to be a good thing or a bad hey. thing? Did we make the right choice? Are we following down the right path? Oh god. <sighs> nice and tender for you. <laughs> That's disgusting. So wait, does it make you like her bite stronger when it happens? I don't even know if she could do it. Like maybe she doesn't want to do it, but at the same time she's like pull away. Yeah, let's not pull away. Gotta let it happen. <laughs> Maybe that's what causes her to transform entirely. One little bite of blood just goes whoop. He should start to feel better soon, I guess. And what if he doesn't? Fuck. Trophy earned. The lobotomy. I had to figure out how to pronounce that. The lobotomy. Or how was that? 
Uh, you feeling better yet, bud? Or... I mean, let's get the fuck out of here, but like, oof. I don't know if he's gonna transform and kill everyone. That's what I'm afraid of. Like, I'm not even gonna lie about that. August 23rd, Dylan, 224, Hackett Scrapyard. Back over here again, huh? Alright, cool. These guys never throw anything out, huh? So, do you want to give me some direction on what we're looking for specifically? Well, most of these cars look like they've already been stripped of parts. Just empty frames and chassis, which doesn't help us much. Okay, so we're looking for engines? Car parts? Well, anything relatively intact. Got it. Nice. How do we know if... You know what, whatever, let's just explore. I don't even know what I was going to ask there. I mean... There's some parts over here, but it looks a little rusted. I mean, I see a little muffler right there, some tires and junk. But I mean, I'm honestly kind of nervous that there's just going to be some random ass werewolf popping out. Uh, nothing we can interact with. Uh, hmm. Well, I mean, I guess all we can do here is just look around. Hope for the best. Uh. What the fuck? What was that? Oh, never mind, it was a sensory light. Jesus fuck, that scared the ever living shit out of me. Uh, sorry about that, you guys. Anything. Over here. I'm not really seeing much of a friggin' area as of right now. Maybe we gotta go on further into it. Again with the fucking sensory lights. Jesus fuck. Uh, dumpster. Again, I'm not really seeing much we can interact with. And then, of course, Caitlyn, you got her over here patrolling around. Like, are you even actually doing anything? Hmm. Uh, looks like there's a gate we can open. But before we do that, I feel like there's other stuff over here that we can interact with. I mean, I don't know. I'm just looking around. I mean, if we go through that gate, there might not be any turning back, so, you know, sometimes it's safe to explore. Even though that's the main point of things. Alright, what's this right here? It looks like we can interact with something right here, pick it up. What are we gonna be touching here? What's that? Remote control? <laughs> to open the gate. Okay, um... Maybe it's better that we interact with that first. Have a documentary. No. Shut up. Come on, let's go. <laughs> the documentary being a video game called The Quarry? Yes. Yeah. Welcome to a documentary, I guess. Alright, um, before we do that, we continue forwards. I'm gonna see, is there anything over here? Like, there could be literally anything, even if there's not. We still gotta make sure anyways, right? I mean, there's an upstairs, so... Can always go up here, maybe, and then see if we have anything useful we can grab a hold of, or maybe like clues we can check out. There is something going right here a sign of some sort. Oh no, it's a calendar for like August. What does that say? Full moon with a circle on it. These sons of bitches had it all planned out. Like different days, they're going to transform into wolves. Wonder if that's what that all means. Okay, that might be the only thing we've got going on here. Unless, is this a note? Uh, who discovered scrapyard note? Who's T? Mm -hmm. Probably Travis. Looks like these guys were cooking the books a little. Dodgy. Okay. The book a little. You know, maybe that's something we should also be doing more. Like, if we see something that has text involved with it, like if it's a clue or evidence, 
we should probably go back and uh, read through it after, you know, we discover it. Alright, Hackett Scrap Metal Invoice. Reg ADDF 674, SUV body damage. Keep this off the books and out of the way. T. Okay. Something to do with this SUV. Okay. Coolio. Um, excuse me, Caitlin, you just cut me off. I mean, didn't really think there's a lot of room over here. Just go through that fucking gate, I guess. <laughs> I don't know what you're wa waiting around for. Right behind you. Actually, no, you're right behind me now. Again with the fucking sensor lights. Jesus fuck. Anything over here? What's... Okay, so it looks like there's a variety of areas we can go to for this scrapyard. So, hopefully, uh, just walking through this little tunnel thing right here, this little tunnel tube, we can find something, just about anything. Please, bro. God fucking damn! Can't keep playing too much, bro. Like, what if I just keep traveling further? Would that end up leading to a like tech point or something? I mean, I don't know how big this scrapyard is, so I'm gonna turn around real quick and see if we can find anything over here in hopes that it's not way too spread out. I mean, I can always go up here first. God, fuck off with them fucking sensory lights, dude. Let's see, up here. Um. Hmm. Looking at a fence right here, are we gonna be able to open it? Or are we just looking out through it? You and Brian's okay? He knows what he's doing. Always safer than we are out here. Come on. I beg to differ. <sighs> oh, Alright. Looks like we're gonna be doing some plenty exploring here. I really don't want to miss anything though. Like, I don't know if there's a certain point to when we get to an area of the scrapyard that we uh, end up into a different checkpoint within the game, but I mean, I don't know. I'm just assuming. Don't know how I didn't get my head on that. Fucking crime that you do, but... Fucking... Hold on, wait, we just came here. Them fucking sensory lights are like... Dramatic drum booming thingies. God. Okay, uh, I guess we're gonna travel further we'll back. Again with the sensory lights. Fucking primany. This is another area. Wait a minute. Is there someone over there? Got like that. What the fuck is it? Is that like a claw machine thing that people use for construction, or am I tripping out? Hold on. I don't know if I've explored everything I have to see, but I feel like going over here is going to trigger a cutscene, maybe. And also, I can hear that fucking crow or raven, whatever the fuck that bird's called. Um. Hmm. Okay, so we can't exactly get over there. I don't think we can. Oh, wait, maybe we can. There's a little staircase over there. Oh, God. I hate that. People really know how to make a game much more scary than it already is. Oh, there's something right here. Clue? Clue discovered. Discarded si signage. 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 Whatever. What's this? I'm probably already missing some clues already. Aram Scarum. Hey, that's the- See this, Caitlin? 
That's the fortune telling old lady on the screen. I just realized that. Well, the sign at least. It's got the crystal ball. Harem Scarum. Huh. I wonder if she's related to the Hackett in any way. Like, there's a lot of things that I have questions to, but I mean, I'm sure we'll end up figuring it out. Wait, where are we supposed to go? Oh, right, over here. Over here, getting distracted, even though there's probably much more stuff that I haven't found already. But, you know, I'm, I'm just trying to look, okay? Come on, anything, give me something. I don't want to wander around aimlessly just not to find anything. I mean, there's got to be a reason why this scrapyard is so big, right? I mean, realistically, scrapyards are fucking pretty big, but... For the plot relevance, damn it! That's what I'm talking about! I just noticed how fucking short Caitlyn is. Compared to Dylan right here. I mean, I guess you get different views depending on who you're playing as. Alright, so are we going up here? I presume so. Can we keep going up, please? Thank you. Jeez, <sighs> fuck. Where even are the sensors installed at? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Oh, we got another card. Ter found Judgment. Okay. I mean, we found something there. But, I mean, we haven't exactly gone to the old fortune telling lady yet. For the other card we picked up. Wait a minute. Okay, sorry about that, you guys. We're trying to get over here to where the, uh... I think catapult thing is at. I don't... It's one of those magnet things that people use to pick up cars. It's one of those vehicles. I don't know what they're called exactly. I'll probably have a caption posted on it. Look. To show what kind of vehicle it is after I do a little bit of research. <laughs> Alright. Where are we at now? Oh, back to the outside, or just a different angle so, of the outside. you ever operated a crane before? Oh, it's a crane. I actually used to be Sorry pretty, that, pretty good at the claw game at my local arcade. The kids used to call me the grabber. The grabber? No, no, uh-uh. Uh-oh. That I sounds that. a little... Yeah. Look, why don't you see if you can lower it down so weird, we can take a look under the hood? Suspicious weird, to be exact. Uh, anxious, can I have the gun or encouraging, watch my back. Uh, I mean, if something pops out and she doesn't have the gun on her, I think we're the only one that's going to be going up there. If she doesn't have the gun on her, then she's going to end up getting attacked. But, I mean, if we encourage her, have her watch her back, then, I mean, she could protect the both, of, uh, both of us. We don't really know what we have coming towards us, so fuck it. Let's be encouraging like a motherfucker. Sure, yeah, sure thing. Um, <laughs> just, uh, watch my back, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think he was a little anxious either way, regardless of what we would have chosen to say anyways. Fucking ignore that caption BS. We're gonna operate a right. crane. Looks like somebody's mom never taught them how to clean Mag up after themselves. A magnetic crane. Okay, let's see what we're working with. Okay, so you got... Alright, not too complicated. You got one hand, and then what are you going to do with the other since you don't have it? Grabber. What the hell is going on? My bad. Turned on some music. Um, the area looks like a little mess right. there, like you just said. Um, someone's Here goes on. nothing. Alright, don't have to clean up. Uh, do we know exactly how to drop that, to be specific? I mean, you're right over Caitlyn's head. I wouldn't aim it right there. Do not drop it. Yeah, see? Careful. Careful. You did it! Yeah, uh, uh, I think I found my calling. About time! <laughs> I mean, sure. Well, 
Maybe we can Whatever see if we can try and get this thing running. Are we gonna try ah, getting it running, or score. are we gonna take some parts out of it so we can fix the van? Oh wait, the van's back at the fucking lodge. Oh. Kind of go too far there. Why the lights just turn on? Someone's over here. Warn Caitlin or lift car. Um, let's warn Caitlin. We don't know what the fuck's going on. Someone. I knew damn well, bro. Ah, oh, shit. No, no, no. Fuck. Caitlin! I hit the wrong joystick. I freaked out. Caitlin, get the damn werewolf off the damn car! God fucking damn it. Who is that? Hurry the fuck up! Is that Jacob? Slam car or sound horn? Uh, what would... Slam the car. It's taking a lot longer than expected. Oh shit, no. Oh fuck. No, don't slam the car. Ah oh, shit, we just fucked up half me. Which werewolf is that? Oh fuck me. We gotta fuck everything up at this point now, huh? Dylan, Everything is going on, perfectly go well. Away, Dylan! Oh god. Ah. I'm spamming, I'm spamming, I'm spamming, I'm spamming. Oh shit. Oh my god. <laughs> Slam it, motherfucker! No! Jesus fuck! Oh my god. I think we just saved our ass. Maybe. Although I don't think laying there on the ground is going to keep it from coming back to life, though. So maybe, um, maybe not get out of there. Maybe Caitlyn get back in the fucking car or something. Dylan, thank you. You actually saved my life. For realsies. For realsies? Yeah, no, no sweat. I just can't wait to see who they choose. What? To play me. In the movie about how brave I am. Don't push it. The movie? Okay. Of how brave you are. <sighs> so. Is the so game trying to become aware of itself or something? Brilliant escape plan. Okay, back to the lodge. Are you nuts? <laughs> Better than being out in the open. <laughs> Who's gonna play me for the movie? <clears throat> more like a video game, but you know. Uh, past updated. Again, it's more like a video game that plays out like a movie, but, you know. <laughs> Oof. Um, that could have gone much better than how that did. Thought Caitlyn would have died there. She fell hard as fuck from that car. Um. Hmm. Where could this be going? Uh, game? Okay, I was about to say what the fuck was going on there. August 23rd, Abigail, 229 Hackett's Quarry Lodge Storm Shelter. It friggin' took a long while to load there. Longer than usual. We can't just sit here. Why not? Dylan said it's safe here. <sighs> yeah, I just, I don't want to be waiting around. But that's literally all we need to do. Just wait until morning, right? Fine. But we need protection. Go see what you can find. It's better than just sitting around. Hey, it'd be her walk around and not you, Emma. <laughs> well, uh, protection. Great, we gotta look around for protection. Can, can, can I get a smooch? <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> Alright, um, let's see. Hello? There is some fucking paranormal activity shit going on. Huh. I wonder if that fortune old, uh, telling old lady has something in relation to this. I'm kind of wondering what her name is now. 
Okay, sorry, I'm getting completely distracted. Search around, I guess. Kind of dark, can't really see, so... Not really much we can find, I don't think. Although I'm pretty sure this is literally where Max got bit, so... If we end up getting attacked or fucked up... That's why. Again, this little staircase thing... Pretty sure- Oh! We got another tear. The Hierophant? Okay, sorry, anyways, again, this literally looks like the little area that Laura and Max went to because they thought they saw someone down here. In which they did, and then, you know, Max got attacked by World, blah blah blah, they got shot by Travis, and then boom. Taken to that cell. There are claw marks on the wall right here. What are we looking at right here? Was there more claw marks or was like some liquid spewed on the ground into like a thin puddle? Um, let's maybe not go up here. We don't want to end up uh, going up there and then letting something in. So, you know, again, let's just continue exploring to where we haven't explored before. Just a random ass chair right there in between these like shelves of bottles, books, boxes, and junk, or whatever the fuck this shit is. Wish I could see and the lighting was better, but you know. Anything at all. You know, Emma, it would be pretty great if you look around too as well. I mean, I don't know if she is or not. Yeah, see, no, she's just standing there. Okay. Fuse box? Surveillance room. Huh. Looks like the main fuse is gone. That's why there's no power? Why would somebody do that? Surveillance room. I wonder if Chris had something to do with this. Because he knew they escaped from the lodger instead of going to the lodge, what is they it? literally disobeyed his orders to Silver go shells. stay there until they get down here. Path updated. There is the hunter must have dropped them. Shotgun shells. It's probably how he got upstairs to attack Caitlin. It's either that or that's from Travis when he was shooting, motherfucker. Or at least trying to. Strange. Also, again. What is this supposed to be? Oh, it's supposed to be like the different power line things. Yeah. Little control thing. Uh, two buttons are missing. That's lovely. Okay. How about over here? Is there anything? Wait a minute. Does this lead to Mr. Hackett's office? What'd you find? Ladder. Oh, I'm just checking out this ladder. Is it gonna break? Is that a like tiny little door there? up there? Uh, yeah. We'll open it up. Why? We don't know it's up there. Break. Exactly. Have you not been paying attention, like, at all? Okay, what I mean is, it might be good for us to have an escape route. You know, we don't know what's up there. It, it, the lodge, there, there also could be a, a way for us to defend ourselves. I mean, she's thinking outside of the box, sort of, but I okay. mean... Okay. Guess that makes sense. We don't really know if we're gonna be ending up pushing ourselves into some sort of dangerous situation right now, but I mean... Pretty sure that's the ladder that leads up to Mr. Hackett's little trap door in his office. But again, hold on. I wonder if it's going to break... You alright? Oh, well, yeah. That, okay, that, was, that was close. Dylan went down it, half updated. Because you remember when we chose to go down it to check out to see what was in there, you know, with Ryan and stuff? It said either path updated or path chosen, I'm not really sure, but. Um, our current objective is to leave the storm shelter via the trapdoor, so it looks like we have to go up to either way. Okay, yep, yeah, right to. Mr. Hackett's office, or Chris. Okay, we're up in here, now what? You gonna, Emma, are you gonna come up, or? Hackett Family House, August 23rd, Laura, 245. Full moon, eh, bud? 
Uh, this hockey house, the more that I look at it, it starts looking weirder and weirder. Oh, they can't the get through there in a hurry. Man, this place is huge. Okay, um, the real question is, Ryan healed? <sighs> You'll feel better soon. Cool. Soon? You I'm think it would have pretty good, actually. Quicker. What are you doing? Stop it. Do you smell that? Smell no. That? Should I be worried? Never mind. Let's just find another way down. A way to Chris Hackett. Or just a way out, maybe. I'm done being chased and stabbed. Sure. And another way out. Uh-huh. Fine. <sighs> Woof. Uh, Ryan, you look a little tired there, bud. Is it seriously not healed now? You think it would have went, whoop, I'm healed. Maybe we have to bite him as a werewolf rather than when we're going under transformation. The floor looks a little fucked up here. Uh, Alright, anyways, uh, continue with the exploration. What are these? Are those huh. valve? What's that? Pray for on the right track. Stay close. Valve yeah, all the better to see you with, my dear. Syringes? Shh. Oh, those are syringes. Yeah, see? I was thinking, like, wait a minute, what the fuck are those? And I was like, oh, I was thinking, I thought, like, between different things. Three different things. Okay, um. There'd be a lot going on over here in this place that we haven't really figured out by now. But, you know, exploring is good, nothing over here, and it seems to be too interesting. Also, is this entire house made out of just literally wood. Like, on the outside of it, it looked like a literal fucking barn or something. An unpainted barn. Uh, got a nice little couch chair thing right there. Okay, we can't go past there, so we gotta go around. That is a fucking werewolf. What Dude. was that? I think... Who is that? Uh, werewolf on chains, I think but... found Chris Hackett. Chris. Son of a bitch. Oh my god. Why are you guys not reacting to that? Fucking shoot, damn it. Oh god, Jesus Christ. Why don't you? Oh, that's. Oh, I'm sorry, Ryan. 310 Hackett Family House. That was anticlimactic. Our little blood is left. She tried to fight against it. Her voice got a little warped. Oh, God damn it, Laura. fucking crystal ball with this with the fortune telling lady Travis got his head fucking knocked off trophy earned mutually assured god damn it dude 
I mean, I'm pretty sure Ryan was gonna transform you either way. Had your chance. Oh Jesus fuck! Hello. You had your chance. Hello. To What's going wipe on? out that wretched family, and you failed. And how was I supposed to do that? Doesn't matter. Are you not related to them? It's still time. Wretched we can family. still come out on top. Past is the past. <gasps> Let's just <clears throat> look to the future, shall we? Um. Sure. The sun, the vitality of a new day. There's still time to wake up to the warmth of a night survived. Your choices, your actions, I still your don't bad life hangs we're playing in balance. As. It's up to you to find your path in I mean, the darkness and see the now. sun rise once again. That Constance lady. Judgment. Judgment Day is upon us. That's what you'd expect from this card, isn't it? <sighs> or perhaps in this case, it's simpler than that. Perhaps one's own judgment, a snap decision to make, can save them from their own personal day of reckoning. Every step matters, every decision tipping the balance one way or the other. Take oh, really? Time. Think. And maybe survive. Do you think uh, you don't think I've literally been trying to this entire time? A hierophant. Okay, that's how you. Where did it. you find this? Where did you find it? Was I not? This shouldn't to be that up? here. He's been through enough pain. No, no, no. Who? No. Huh? What? My poor boy. Are you your poor you boy? See what it did to us. The fuck? You're not gonna let me look through the vault six years ago, Eliza Packets Corey. Wait. No. Is that what the fortune telling old lady's name is? Is Eliza? <laughs> what have they done? The harem scarum attraction. Is that what, what have they is? done? Oh! Wait, is she a witch? Or is she like a paranormal ghost? Um, okay, so it looks like we gotta look around. Is that all we can do? Oh shit, dead person. Parent, scare, sideshow. Sideshow, Silas the dog boy. Werewolf? Silas. Is that who her son is? Silas, I'm born! <laughs> Is that why we could hear his name being whispered throughout the game? Was he the first werewolf? Okay, so now it looks like we're controlling the old lady here. Um, oh shit. Maybe for like a split second. Oh, um, damn. Did she end up dying up in flames here? I feel like she is a ghost or something. Maybe like a spirit. Maybe that's what happened. An explosion. Uh, uh, let's not run into that. Jesus, fuck. I mean, would have our decision mattered? How did this happen is the real question. I'm starting to really wonder if they are related to the Hackets. I mean, I don't know. A badge? <laughs> Who does that belong to? Oh, she looks like she's super out of it. Take your meds there, woman? Gotta have a heart attack? What was that? Oh, it's blood. So she's not getting infected? Um, Mommy's coming, Silas. Okay. Mommy's coming, Silas! Silas! Wait. Silas! I thought that's who. Is that not who that dead corpse is? Or did. The Silas guy break out of that cage right there. That 
seems a little fucked up that you have your son in a cage. Okay, um, the story is starting to get even more confusing. It looks like she's got her cards flying around. Maybe that's why she has whoever picking them up for her. Okay, uh, this is getting weird. No, 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 no. Oh, back to the freaking. My poor boy. Okay. You see what they did to us? How they hurt us? He's out there still, all alone. Um. Each full moon, they looked him armed with silver, trying to put an end to a curse they inflicted upon themselves when they set my the one we have to kill. six years ago. We have to kill Silas. Silas. Guys, I figured it out. I think I did. You must be protected. No, I think we're you gonna must kill that not motherfucker. Follow this path. You understand? Remember how I helped you all this time? Who the fuck am I playing as? You gotta be more specific, woman. Remember how much I've done for you. Who? Making my brain hurt, dog. Okay. Uh. Arcs, my third. Kitland, 332, Haggins Quarry Lodge. Chapter 10, Bricks and Mortar. Okay, chapter 10. This table, help me. You're gonna barricade the door? Oh, lovely. Also, is this place falling apart or is it just me? Is it just the lighting? Okay. Ugh. Oh. Trophy urn, chapter Can't nine. get much worse than it already is, right? Great. Uh, Just like the cartoons. It's been off and all night. Thundering and lightning? Gives us a little time. How do you figure? They don't like water, remember? Right. Right. Uh, clearly. Oh. We should have just been swimming in the lake all, right, all night. in the poem. And die of hypothermia? No. All right, well... We're good now. I mean, are there Night's any showers there. nearby? These fuckers know we're in here. And they're coming back the first chance they get. Great news. For sure. Okay. For sure. Alright. We gotta get a vantage point. And where would that be? Would that be like more upstairs? Eh, we'll figure it out later on. But for now, that's all we have for this episode, you guys. Be sure to like and subscribe. Comment down in the comments below some video ideas, and I will see you all in the next video. Our current objective is to find a vantage point. We will get to that very soon. This game is becoming very, very confusing for me, but you know what? It is what it is. We'll deal with this later on. Bye, y'all.